Hey everybody, welcome back. We're last left off. We just started our story. Uh, no one's here. What? What? Who is this even? Casual discussion. No one's here. I mean, that guy's walking down the street. Wait. Uh, Spice Festival's in town. Uh, was this guy here yesterday? Dude, did are you coming to return your toilet? Did the toilet break? Also, I just got like 500 bucks. I, I think it, it went by really fast, but I think that was like my money. Are you really in need of another toilet or do you want to buy the gnome? So we get perk points every time we do this. Okay, you know what? Good opening for this episode. Let's buy some stuff. Let's let's make the store better. Let's make the garage, <laughs> the garage, uh, or rather the yard sale better. Um, this is a wall mounted one, right? Yeah? Okay. We don't need that. Let's, let's get this. Apparently makes the business more attractive. So we'll put this, uh, right at the corner. So when people are walking down the street, you know, they see this, um, it, uh, promotes the fine toilets we sell. Not good market. It looks like a coffee shop thing to me. Huh. What's this? Power crystal D What? It's a wall decal. Okay. I guess it just makes the place look nicer. Uh, the lice cold freezer. Practically room temperature. Can purchase perishable food and harvests f directly from- Okay. That's cool. Okay, so we'll have a vending machine out here plugged into nothing. That's cool. Shelving unit. We're gonna have a building eventually, I swear. We just don't have the money. Ooh. Ooh, that's fancy. Yeah, we, we gotta put some stuff on that. We'll put it like right next to here because they're like the same-ish color. It looks a little bit bush league, but we'll make it work. Trust me. Now we gotta find stuff to put on there. Electronics, maybe? Smoke detectors? We could be a smoke detector only store. Uh, this is too big for that. Uh, huh. Can't fit a miniature television on it. Can we get some small appliances on there? No, that's a big microwave. Oh, come on, this coffee machine's small enough to go on that one. A tea machine. Come on, what, what can we pick? Kids toys? Hey! Yeah. Kids love books, right? I can't put that on the side there? Come on. Ooh, that's an expensive toy car. You know, we don't have a whole lot of money left in the business funds right now. Let's sell a backpack. <laughs> that's... There we go. Okay. Now mark that for sale. What's this? Stop calling me! I'm at work! So do we, like, manually put stuff in there? Come hang it. Yeah, at work? Sure. Come to my work and hang out. Buy stuff. Pl uh, we gotta put actual food in there. <laughs> Damn. Hi, you teleported here. Greet the customer, greet the customer. Yeah, have have fun with your coffee. Just hang out at work. God, she's the most annoying person in the world. But I was just like, I just spent like three game days trying to get some cash. And she called me like every day three times. Beg for sale. Oh, I'm tense. Low fun? What's not fun about uh, chatting with these people? Come on. Let's not vent to a customer. Vent to your f insane friend over there. Isn't it her abilities and traits and stuff is like she's a psychopath? Yeah, she's hot-headed, hates children, and is insane. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, yeah. Finish your venting. Feel better. Complain about problems. Oh no, I don't want them all here hearing this. 
Who comes to a yard sale and then buys shit because they hear the owner bitching? Sorry, I was hoping that'd make me feel better, guys. Uh, you, you wanna- I'm gonna brighten your day, maybe it'll brighten mine too. Are you, are you yelling at him? Don't yell at him. God, he's got awesome fashion sense. Answer questions. Oh sweet, I'm happy now. Pleasant conversation? Sweet. Okay, fixed it. Um, still not having fun, but uh, not much I can do about that. Can I just manually move that into the garbage? Okay, that saves me some time. Can I make coffees and then put them in there? <laughs> Receptive to sales pitch. Uh, give him a sales pitch. Suggest options. Tip, uh, trip brought home 250 bucks. Not bad. Let's just look. Okay, household funds and retail store. Okay. Just, I, it's hard to tell which one's which for me. I'm, I'm stupid. Uh, transfer a thousand of the, of the home funds. Uh, I, oh, no, no. Other way around game. Yeah. Why is she doing push-ups? Why is she doing push-ups? This is weird. Stop it. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> She showed up to my yard sale and she's doing push-ups and bragging about it or some shit. Fucking psychopath. You're enthused about the store? Yeah. What are you doing over there? You're scaring my customers. Uh, answer question. Just get them to buy something, please. I'm never inviting her here again. Okay, we're getting sales points. Charisma is not going up fast enough. Oh god, we're tense again. Okay. Do we practice singing? Will that- will that cheer us up? Sing. Sing. Just sing out your frustrations. Oh, he sings about as well as I do. This is not good. This is a shit show. Okay, what can we buy? Uh, maybe I want the provocative pedestal. Get it. Because okay, so that just unlocks the ability to buy it, right? Okay, provocative pedestal. This is not organized well. Okay, so it's like a it's like a knee-high uh wooden desk that's brown, right? I don't see it. It's not that. Cause I know there was like something down here that said like uh click a thing to unlock a thing. Uh, yeah, see it says they're like unlocks at purchasing a thing, so I'm guessing they're not all at the bottom automatically, huh? Why does this have a special background? Oh, provocative pedestal! Okay, so it just looks different. I guess I unlocked multiple of them or something. Um, it, it says there's like an unboxing picture for it there, and I'm not sure... Household inventory! Oh, there is a household inventory! I just missed it! Okay. Okay, cool. Um, uh, I don't- I don't want these woodworking in progress things. Just get rid of them. Okay, provocative pedestal. So we can use that to sell stuff. What's this? Pardon me, do you have the time? D or does the time have you? Make a bold statement in the ownership of time with a sentinel from the reclamation houseware. A fully functioning clock made of 100% reclaimed garbage. Is this a wall-mounted thing? It's a wall-mounted thing. Damn, or else I'd sell it. Uh, can I sell a pile of hard drives on the ground? Let's try. Set for sale. <laughs> am I having fun singing to myself? I am. Okay, stop singing. You're good. Everyone thinks you've fucking had a psychological break. So let's just, uh... Go back to selling things! In fact, now that we have a little bit more money, let's sell more things! We can sell, uh, that, that was a misclick. We can, uh, we can sell, uh, decorations. 
I'm gonna sell some plants. I want, I want small plants. That, that can't go on the table? Okay, it can go on the table. I'm selling that plant. I'm selling that plant. I, I can't put the lily pad on it. Huh! And I'm selling those three plants. Those are all for sale, and they're on pedestals! So you really wanna buy them, right? Look at that variety! We got gardening, we got toilets, we got a gnome, a couple books, we got a backpack. This is variety. We got a hard drive. You don't know what you're gonna get when you got a hard drive, you know? Oh, I, I can ring that dude up. Man, you never know what you're gonna get going to the Madri Bread store that I forget the name of. Preeminent Domain. I really gotta get a new name. I'm just- I, I just want to ring up the back of your head real quick. Is that cool? It's a party. It's a party here at uh, Preeminent Domain. Look at this. They've only got mannequins in that store. I've got customers. I'm selling at least one thing. Look at that guy swagger in here. Yeah, we sold a toilet. Modern Relief. Greet him. Let's go restock our toilet. It's got to make him feel at home, you know? Maybe he'll buy the hard drive. Who knows what kind of incriminating evidence I have on that hard drive. It's like buying a pack of cards. You never know what you're going to find within. What strange illegal things will be on those hard drives when you buy them? Who knows? Maybe they don't even work. Maybe there are no refunds at my store. You know, I'd probably make more sales if I lowered the markup. Uh, if I lower it, I'd make less money, but I also make more sales and that would get me perk points. I hate that I don't have like an upgrade cycle thing to go through, you know? Seems lame. That was in the second game. Why would they take it out? Would you restock that faster? There we go. We got points for that too. Nice. Hey, hey, it's actually keeping track of our outgoing costs now. I want to vent to someone? Go vent to my friend. Um... Is she yelling at someone? Complain about problems? Does that Oh! She disappeared. Okay. It's, it's cool. It's cool. We're just gonna sing a little bit more. Just... Let that stress out. Lay, 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 Look at me, guys. I'm a sim. All right. Stop singing and go tend to the customers. Does he want the, um, that weed that I put in a planter? It's worth a lot of money. I think it was like 30 bucks. Mm. You know what I should be doing? I should be harvesting my plants and then putting them in this thing. Yeah! 31 bucks? I make a whole six dollar profit on this. Maybe I shouldn't be selling cheap items. Seems like it's worth more hassle. I mean, I would imagine people are more likely to buy them though. I greet that customer after. I think it's the only one we haven't greeted. Yeah. Oh. You, 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 you wanna buy stuff? Are you, are you turning over this way? Mr. Hank? Hank! Hank! Oh, he didn't want to buy anything. Well, we're making a profit so far. You dress like the biggest asshole I've ever seen in my entire fucking life. Reese Owens. Uh, another person! Who are you? You're, uh, Alice Harlow. Go greet Alice. Greet Alice. Turn around, greet Alice. D did that count? I didn't even look at her. Don't, don't beg for a sale. Don't be tense, dude. Okay. Okay, here's what we do. We gotta tend to our employees, even if we're the only employee. We need to find some kind of entertainment. Um... Activities, maybe? We can sell guitars. 
Super shot basketball. We could play basketball at work. No, we'd smell bad by the end of it. Uh, what do we, what do we do? What do we do? I could have a bonfire. You know, that doesn't seem like the worst idea. Have a bonfire out front. That's actually huge. You know what? Maybe that maybe that is a poor move. I'm not gonna do that. I was thinking I'll have a bonfire you could hang around and maybe you'd get up and uh, buy something, you know? Chemical analyzer. What a weird thing to buy that would be. Huh. Okay, I want electronics. Maybe we should have a TV to just watch and not even buy. <laughs> well, hmm, could we help with the ambient happiness if we had a boombox? Can't put it over there. I could just put it on the ground. <laughs> a boombox that's not for sale. But we just have on it. You can dance! Let's do it. And then, uh... And then we'll have a TV for sale. Maybe we should be putting it on the table. Well, if we, uh... No, I, I don't... Okay, delete button. Okay, cool. Hmm. I just wanna... Yeah! We can, uh, we can relocate these. Really? That can't go on that? Can this? No? Are you kidding me? Right. Here you go. go nope, nope, nope. Set for sale again. Okay. And set that for sale so we sell a TV. Listen to music. That will get me happier at work. Would, would you go over there already? Listen to music? No, get out of this conversation. I don't care. Thank you. I need to break off this conversation and just enjoy some sweet tunes. Change it to... Change it to... Oh, this sounds awful. What's... Do classical. Good, there we go. You see? Yeah, we're having some fun with that, listening to music. Just zoning out, ignoring my customers. I'm the only employee. God, do I want to hire Trip? What happens if I hire Trip? Do I just not pay him? Cause I'm cool. I'm pretty cool with not paying Trip. I don't know. He'd probably start like choking the. Uh, he'd probably start walking around and like. Oh, do you wanna? You want me to talk to you? Cause I can go talk to you. I'm happy now. He's probably gonna like start choking. Fucking customers and stuff, cause Trip's an asshole. Hi, you wanna you wanna buy product? Oh, that guy wants to buy a thing. Go answer his questions. He's really close to buying a thing. Neither of these people want to buy anything. They're just fucking freeloaders. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you wanna buy, right? You wanna you wanna you wanna buy stuff? Ask about your price range. Come on. Tell me you're rich. Tell me you're rich. Buy the TV. It's like a thousand bucks. It's my most valuable item. Uh. Go answer his questions. Maybe he wants to buy shit. I know for a fact Mortimer Goth is rich. He was rich in every game. Alright, just top off this dude's sale because he's close to it and I really want to make some money today. Okay, our perk points are getting a little bit high again, at least high for such a terrible business. Our business funds are basically non-existent right now. Is, is he gonna buy? Like, he's gonna for sure buy? Can we just, like, uh... No, we're not, we're not getting the thing for, like, finishing things off? I just kind of want to finish the sale, you know? Like, surely he's going to buy it. There we go. Go ring him up. 
So, question for the comment section. Have you ever in your entire goddamned life gone to a store, met a bunch of strangers, and had this much fun talking to them? Why do I keep going directly behind the person to ring them? I'm just tapping his shoulder. That's all I'm doing. I'm just button input on his shoulder. Everyone's so freakishly happy in Sims games. Alright, that's sale made. Oh, you- you're done too? Yeah, go ring up that customer. Yeah, we're making money. So what's the next thing we want to save up for? I can't- no- no point in bothering with this until I get, um... <laughs> no use, uh, getting that until I can, uh... The English language is way too difficult for me, I'm actually an idiot. Uh, until I have walls. Superfluous surplus. The store's uh, supplier ordered too much inventory and are temporarily reducing prices to clear space. The cost of restocking items will be reduced for 12 hours. It can be repurchased again in the future. Okay, so this is when I need to when I need to go around and restock a lot of things all at once. Good to know. Uh, so I don't know what this other register does, but I'm really curious. I feel like that might be the next thing I'm gunning for. And then, like, faster checkout and restocking seems important. This is, uh, who celebrates ultimate domination of the marketplace. Curious shopper. Spend more time browsing the items before they decide to leave. So that's probably if you have a lot of items, that's good. Mega manager. Greater chance of succeeding with social interactions performed on store employees. Serious shopper. More of a desire to buy things. Okay. Instant restock, cheaper restock. God, that seems good, because that's just straight up more profit. Okay, so I'm going to have to restock after I'm done selling this. So is she buying the TV? Because the TV is her highest profit item. 25% up on the TV is like a solid $200 or something. I do like this whole, like, what your profit of the day is breakdown. Okay, sweet, so it's like a $1,000 TV. Yeah, restock that right away, because I really want our biggest seller to stay on the market. Who's this dude? Have I seen him before? Pat Hatfield. Didn't I interact with him in a park on a previous episode? I don't know, it was like a year and a half ago that I recorded this game last. Um, but yeah, didn't I interact with him in a park? I don't remember. Okay, people are starting to finally shut up. Where things, wow, he decided he wanted to buy that real fast. No, I don't want to chat with Pat. I just want to ring him up. He's flirty, okay. Yeah, ring up. Did you just undecide? Oh no, it was you who wanted to buy. Okay, I'm stupid. Yeah, 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 so cool. Just go, go ring him up. R ring him up. Ring him up. Thank you. Can they not fix this whole thing? Is it a pathfinding error? What is it? Okay, it looks okay here, but they're real close. It's a little creepy. So yeah, if we were to get Trip as an employee, I would imagine we wouldn't have to pay him, right? Maybe we can't get him as an employee for that reason. But I don't think I would have to pay trip. Okay, yeah, get back to restocking. Restocking is the most important thing to me, is restocking and selling. Actually talking to the customers is a lower priority, because I want them to have as much variety as possible. I feel like that does a better job of guaranteeing a sale than talking to them, considering my charisma is not amazing. I hope the music playing is helping. It seems like it's helping with my happiness a little bit. Like my fun meter's going down slower because we have a boombox going. It's probably helping with the customers, too. Been open for 11 hours. I've been standing for 11 hours. Yeah, we don't have a bathroom. We don't have food here. We're gonna have a proper store one day. I'm excited for that, actually, when I finally, like, build a store. I think I'll probably do it between episodes one day when we've got the cash. I'll start actually, like, building a structure. Wow, that guy is buff as fuck. Oh, it was that guy. Yeah, he was here the other day. The guy with the crazy strut. Are you almost done? Uh, oh, you're uncomfortable because you need to go to the bathroom. Uh, 
Okay, um, well, there's not much I can do about that either than closing shop for the day. Well, I wish the bars would go back of, over their heads. Uh, are they really not even considering those? Alright. Alright, we're closing shop for the day then. Net profit of 500 bucks? Can not bad for such a new business. Out in the middle of a yard. Set that for not sale and use it. In public. Confident! That's pretty confident. Oh, he's also tense. What are you confident for? Because he's self-assured, okay. There we go, and put it back on sale. Yeah. All right, our business funds are 600 bucks, not great. And uh, can we uh, buy retails or take another vacation day? Yeah, set that up ahead of time. There we go. All right. Next episode, uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna look into the price. There's an there's an angry me. I'm gonna look into the price of starting to actually develop an actual physical store, um, and then I am going to go home, sleep, and take care of my needs. And then when you catch us on the next episode, we'll be ready to go back to work. I don't want to waste your time. Until next time, have a nice day.